Peter Dusler Ornus, known professionally as Peter Graves, was an American film and television actor. He was best known for his starring role in the CBS television series Mission Impossible from 1967 to 1973 and from 1988 to 1990. His elder brother was actor James Arness. Graves was also known for his portrayal of airplane pilot Captain Clarence Overure in the 1980 comedy film Airplane, and its 1982 sequel Airplane 2. The sequel, Early Life, Peter Graves was born Peter Dusler Ornus on March 18, 1926, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, the son of Rolf Zirkler Ornus, a businessman, and his wife Ruth, a journalist. Graves' ancestry was Norwegian, German, and English. The family name originally was Orusnus, but when Rolf's Norwegian father, Peter Orusnus, immigrated to New York City in 1887, he changed the spelling. Peter used the stage name, Graves, a maternal family name, to honor his mother's family, and also so as to not be confused with his older brother. James Arness, the star of the television series Gunsmoke. Graves graduated from Southwest High School in 1944 and spent two years in the United States Army Air Forces near the end of World War II. He then enrolled at the University of Minnesota on the GI Bill and was a member of Phi Kappa Psi fraternity. Career Graves appeared in more than 70 films, television shows, and television movies during his career. In 1955, Graves joined the NBC television series Fury as the rancher and adoptive single father, Jim Newton. Graves also was featured in the 1953 World War II film, Stalag 17. From 19661 Graves starred as leading character Christopher Cobb in 34 episodes of the TV series Whiplash. In the storyline Cobb is an American who arrives in Australia in the 1850s to establish the country's first stagecoach line, using a bullwhip rather than a gun to fight the crooks that he encounters. The series also starred Anthony Wicket. Graves also starred in the British-made ITC series Court Martial playing U.S. Army lawyer Major Frank Whitaker as well as guest roles in such series as Alfred Hitchcock Presents, Samaran City, Route 66 and The Invaders. In 1967, Graves was recruited by DeSalu Studios to replace Stephen Hill as the lead actor on Mission Impossible. Graves portrayed the iconic character of James Phelps, the sometimes gruff director of the Impossible Missions Force or IMF, for the six following seasons of the series. After the series ended in 1973, Graves played a cameo-type support role in the feature film Sidecar Races in Australia which was released in 1975. Graves also made a guest appearance in the teen soap opera Class of 74 in mid-1974, playing himself. Graves was cast as a Palmer Kirkby in the 1983 ABC miniseries The Winds of War. He played opposite Robert Mitchum, Jan Michael Vincent, Deborah Winters and Ali McGraw in what became in 83, the second most watched miniseries of all time. After playing mainly serious roles in the 1970s, he appeared as Captain Clarence Overview in the early 80s comedies Airplane and Airplane 2. The sequel. In 1988 a Hollywood writer's strike resulted in a new Mission Impossible series being commissioned. Graves was the only cast member from the original series to return as a regular, reprising his role as James Phelps, though others made guest appearances. The series was filmed in Australia, and Graves made his third journey there for acting work. The new version of Mission Impossible lasted for two seasons, ending in 1990. Bookending his work on Mission Impossible, Graves starred in two pilot films called Call to Danger, which were an attempt to create a Mission Impossible-style series in which Graves played a government agent who recruited civilians with special talents for secret missions. 
the 1960s version of the pilot, according to Patrick White in The Complete Mission, Impossible Dossier, is credited with winning Graves the role of Phelps, after Mission, Impossible ended in 1973, Graves filmed a third version of the pilot, but it did not sell as a series. The concept was later used in the brief 1980s adventure series Masquerade. During the 1990s, he hosted and narrated the documentary series Biography on A&E. He also acted in a number of films featured on Mystery Science Theater 3000, which subsequently featured running jokes about Graves' biography work and presumed sibling rivalry with R.N.S. The films that have been featured on Mystery Science Theater 3000 include SST, Death Flight, It Conquered the World, Beginning of the End, Parts, The Clonus Horror, and an uncredited voiceover in The Eye Creatures. The film Killers from Space was featured in the film Crew, Michael J. Nelson's follow-up to MST3K. Graves himself parodied his biography work in the film Men in Black 2, hosting an expose television show. He also played Colonel John Camden on the television series Seventh Heaven. In the 1996 film update of Mission, Impossible, the character of Phelps was reimagined as a traitor who murders three fellow IMF agents only to be killed himself at the end of the film. A decision that disappointed Graves, as well as many fans of the original series. On October 30, 2009, Graves was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Airtran Airways featured Graves in a series of web-only, internet videos in 2009 in which Graves appeared in a pilot's uniform and references, classic airplane, lines. The videos were part of an Airtran Airways campaign to promote their in-flight wireless internet access. In the summer of 2009 Graves signed on as a spokesman for reverse mortgage lender American Advisors Group. Graves appeared in a national commercial in which he marketed reverse mortgages. Graves' final project was narrating the computer game Epic Dark Star. The interactive movie, released November 5, 2010. Personal life. Graves was a devout Christian. He was married to Joan Endress Graves from 1950 until his death. Death. After returning from a brunch on March 14, 2010, Graves collapsed and died of a heart attack at the age of 83, four days before his 84th birthday. Awards. Graves was awarded a Golden Globe Award in 1971 for his role as Jim Phelps in the series Mission, Impossible. He also received nominations for an Emmy Award and Golden Globe Awards in other seasons of that show. Graves also won a Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Informational Series in 1997 as host of Biography, Filmography, Upfront, Ford Defiance. The Congregation, Red Planet Mars, Stalag 17, War Paint, East of Sumatra, Beneath the Twelve Mile Reef, Killers from Space, The Yellow Tomahawk, The Raid, Black Tuesday, Fort Yuma, The Long Grey Line, Robber's Roost, Wichita, Fury TV Series, The Naked Street, the Night of the Hunter, The Court Martial of Billy Mitchell, It Conquered the World, Hold Back the Night, Canyon River, Beginning of the End, Bayou, Death in Small Doses, Wolf Larsen, A Stranger in My Arms, Whiplash, A Rage to Live, Texas Across the River, Branded Senator Keith Ashley in, The Assassins, The Ballad of Josie, Mission, Impossible, Mission, Impossible vs. The Mob, Sergeant Riker, The Five-Man Army, The President's Plane is Missing, Call to Danger, Where Have All the People Gone, Scream of the Wolf, Sidecar Races, The Mysterious Monsters, High Seas Hijack, Missile X, The Neutron Bomb Incident, Death Car on the Freeway, Buck Rogers in the 25th Century Episode, Return of the Fighting 69th, The Rebels, the Clonus Horror, Survival Run, The Memory of Eva Riker, Airplane, The Guns and the Fury, Savannah Smiles, Airplane 2, The Sequel, The Winds of War, Aces Go Places 3, Murder, She Wrote One Episode, Number One with a Bullet, 
War and Remembrance, The Golden Girls 1 Episode Mother Load, Adam's Family Values, 7th Heaven 11 Episodes, House on Haunted Hill, These Old Broads, Men in Black 2, Looney Tunes, Back in Action, House 1 Episode, Cold Case 1 Episode, The Hen House, American Dad, 1 Episode, Word Girl, Jack's Family Adventure, Dark Star, The Interactive Movie Game.